<laughs> Hi, my name is Eileen. I'm a fashion and lifestyle illustrator and I'm also an illustration lecturer. I think a great leader is to be able to inspire and motivate others to move towards uh, based on their experience and insight. Uh, leaders also inspire their team not based on their goals or outcomes, but uh, through their exhibited behavior, life outlook and attitude in any given situation. So uh, this links to positivity. So because even the calmest uh, workplace can get stressful at times so it's very important how a leader react with positive outlook rather than getting stressed up and i think it's never easy to become a leader uh, because in life we never stop learning balance has always been something i've struggled with so in the last several years, I have been working as a fashion illustrator and a full-time lecturer and program coordinator at a local university. My personality is uh, keep working until I get the project done, no matter what. Plus, I'm responsible uh, not only for my own project, but also for my client's project, which put lots of pressure on myself. So last year, I finally decided that, okay, I need to make a change because it was no fun running my own projects and living stressfully because I wasn't taking care of myself. So I switched to a contract-based lecturer and then I set the time for my own project. Uh, so I focus on uh, creative projects, meeting clients and also plan fun experiences uh, outside of work. So this keeps me focused on everything I did well instead of getting down on myself uh, about what I didn't have time to complete. Uh, the most important skill for a fashion illustrator would be creativity and drawing skill. Uh, you have to pay a lot of price by putting a lot of hard work and efforts in improving drawing skills. It is very important when it comes to uh, life drawing, events, and uh, the human figure and portraits are generally the hardest to illustrate. So uh, in fashion illustration, it is very important to have the experience of gesture drawing and painting the body in motion. Uh, your illustration is what makes you stand out among others. Failure is a very real possibility in any business venture and we shouldn't let our insecurity keep us from dreaming big. And uh, failure also shouldn't be viewed as something negative or an excuse uh, to stop ourselves from chasing our goals. So when you hear no again and again, when your plans doesn't turn out, see that as a teaching moment or a learning lesson because the road to success is never easy. So I will encourage all the women out there to spend some me time to take in all the advice, uh, filter out the noise and learn from your mistakes. Uh, but whatever you do, do not give up. I hope my words encourage and motivates you. Happy International Women's Day.